okay you guys in this video I love to show you something that I just learned so I hope you guys like it we're going to pick up 15 this time of these blue sea beads Come them again. Fifteen right here. Now two of the clear ones. And we pick up fifteen more. Now two more of the clear one. I'm sorry if you guys hear noises. That will be my little Kiwa. She's down here in the office with me, so I'm sorry for the noises. Now we are gonna tie it. You, if you don't like to pass the needle through all the seed beads, you can go ahead and make knots like I like to do that. So I'm making my nuts right there. You can, if you make nut, make one or two, or make it double like like that, and then one more. So your work is very secure. Okay, it's like that. I do not like to make nuts because I like to and do the work if I make a mistake so that way I didn't waste my thread but in this case I figured if I leave the thread without nuts it just come out and make me work double so hopefully this time work better we're gonna pass the needle into the next CB which is the clear one like that Now we're going to pick up two of the clear ones and we pass it right here into the next clear one, just like that. Now right here we're going to pick up one, escape one and pass it in all through the next one. We're going to do the same thing all the way until we get to the other part where the clear ones are, alright? Pick up one, escape one, pass the needle through the next one. And we do the same thing until we get into this part over here where the clear beads are, all right? I have very little time on my camera, so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to even finish one turn, so, I mean, second turn. we see about that. So this is it's up to you. You can put it in nine, you can put it in 15, 
you can put it in 21 or however you like this earring long or short all right if you like it longer than this you can put some more now we pick up two of the clear one pass the needle through the next one right there like that try to stack them up properly sometimes they didn't want to all right so we continue pick up one escape one pass the needle through the next one This is the last one, so we escape one. Right here, always going to be the same. Escape one, pass the needle through the last two. Like so. And that was the first one after you make the little circle or whatever that you call this form this is the second turn so again pick up two pass the needle through the next one Pick up one, escape one, pass the needle through the next one. And we're going to do the same thing. Two more turns with this one. Or one more turn after this one. Or depends on how you guys like it. If you like it thicker than that, you can go ahead and make more turns if you like it. That's up to you. You can modify this during however you guys like it. Sometimes I get out of the center, so I'm sorry for that. When I go out focus, it's because I pay no attention in what I'm doing and I forget about to pay attention in where I am, right here, right here, you know, whatever, and all the sun, I'm all the way over here, all the way over there, most of the time all the way down here, so I'm sorry for that.
This is the end of the turn again. Pick up one, escape one, pass the needle through the last two. Like this. One more. We're going to do the same thing we've been doing in these three turns. Well, I hope you guys like it as much as I do. Like you guys see, I have so much mess right here. I'm sorry for that. I didn't even notice, so I guess I make the video with all that kind of mess. So I'm sorry for that. I wish I know how to take it out, the stuff that is around the area. But I didn't pay attention into that, so I'm so sorry for all the mess. Well, thank you very much for watching my videos. And will you please not forget to comment, rate, and subscribe to my channels. I really appreciate that so much.